did it, 2021, last night, Way sitting back. at this very table, and we are starting 2022. Sitting at this very table. No, we were on the couch. We Same, were on the couch. but at the vlog, we ended the vlog Kayla sitting. Drunk. No, <laughs> Haley didn't drink anything because she's underage. <laughs> we had a glass of champagne. And All the Kayla girls couldn't handle it. So in Canada, if you live with your parents and your parents let you have a very small glass of champagne at New Year's Eve, it's allowed. <laughs> Anyway, it's true. The girls had a tiny sip of wine and champagne last night, and Kaylee, it got to Kaylee's head, that little tiny it did sip. Not, it did, did not, not get to Kaylee's head is a lie. She just had extra fun last night. I hope you all are having fun and an amazing do it, do it, Gabby, do it, first day to the new year. All I know is it is noisy. Last night, we ended 2021, and it was noisy, and today is... Kaylee got a boyfriend last night. <laughs> Kaylee got a boyfriend last night. All right, let's talk about it. Kaylee, tell them how you got a boyfriend. So, listen, this guy asked me out and I said, obviously I'll go out with you. Wait, what time was this? Was this after midnight? Yeah, a lot after. It's probably 3.30 a.m. At 20.20, 3.30 a.m. in 2022, Kaylee gets a boyfriend. And he told me he'd take me to a fancy dinner and I said, no. And then he told me I had a bad attitude. We almost got a guy to come to the house. Yeah, and drop us off at McDonald's. Same guy, same guy. And he's like, will you be my girlfriend? I said, obviously I'll be your girlfriend. And then two seconds later I said, it's not working out, it's you, not me. <laughs> and then he's like, I know, I'm really sorry. I know you had to put up with the law and blah, blah, blah. 30 seconds. I'm like, yeah, you're just too much. So. That was that. And then he said, good night, hon. I'll take you out to your fancy dinner soon. I said, no. <laughs> it's just too nice, right, Kaylee? <laughs> Tells me I have a horrible attitude. Yeah, what a sweetheart. <laughs> Love of my life. So my very first, our very first thing that we did as a family in 2021 is get rid of the Christmas tree. I just walked through where the Christmas tree was. It feels good to be back to having space in our house and it's still a mess. <laughs> it's still a mess, you guys, but we can see. We can see through. I'm gonna go get the dog's bed back and put it back in that corner. You'll have your bed back. She's like, okay, I want my bed back. Let's scratch my bum. Scratch my bum first. Yeah, I scratch my bum. And she can't even hear a word I'm saying. She's just happy to have her butt scratched. Do you like it? Do you like it? Aww. Yeah. She's like, do it more. Do it more. She's the cutest puppy. I can't remember if I showed you guys the sign that I got for Christmas. I think I must have. It says grandkids make life more grand. And then it has all my grandkids listed. I only have four grandkids. I have five kids, only four grandkids. It just seems crazy to me that I have so few grandkids. One thing you guys might not know about me is that I am a big numbers person. I see numbers, I feel numbers, I have like special connection with numbers, and 22 has always been a super, super, super special number for me. I've loved it for years and years and years, and I just feel like 2022 is gonna be a, such a special year, and I'm so excited. I'm so excited it's here. I'm so excited for all of God's plans to work themselves out this year, and I'm excited to see so many changes because Change is the spice of life, you guys. Change is the spice of life. Anyway, um, uh, welcome to today and welcome to 2022. And let's get on with this day. Before we get on with 2022, I have a little bit of footage of what we did last night. Just a tiny bit. We went live with you guys. It was super fun on Instagram. But also, we did a few things on Snapchat and uh, videoed the girls. And show you guys that footage now. And then we'll get on with the video. One of the things I love the best about Kaylee being over, especially late at night on New Year's Eve, is snapping fans and subscribers on Snapchat. Is that what you're doing? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because Kaylee found a good one. No, I, I don't think you want. Wait. Oh, okay. On this one? I th I, no, I think it's a good one. I think okay. Good. Okay. Um, I don't know the name, so I can't say it. And I don't know if she wants her name. Okay. But it says, Hi, Laura. I've been watching your videos for four years now. I am so impressed with how much you guys have grown over the years. As a fellow mom, I know how important it is 
for you and your children to be with horses, even when things get crazy and lasting impact it will have in their lives. I'm a mom of seven. Some of my kids are in jumping, other in rodeo. They are homeschooled as well. Keep doing what you're doing. You're doing great. P.S. My eight-year-old really wants her barrel horse in the picture, so this is who it is. This is Blackjack, and he has taken my daughter to many rodeos over the years. Aww, so aww he's adorable. We love Blackjack. I love this. This is my favorite. Kaylee, you're bringing this back to our fans. Okay, so she has her own Snapchat, and she sent it to <laughs> this on her daughter's phone but if you do want to add her she has her own snapchat all right well let's add her and let's message her back and say we love snap we we love black that, that like two years ago yeah when did she send that monday okay say so we love black jack black jack yeah, that's her horse. No, black with a V. Oh, black jack. Black jack. <laughs> black jack. Okay. I know, but that's and then what we have felt it. Is he on the other line? I can't believe you replied. Are you a fan account or are you real? Oh. <laughs> Kaylee brings up the camera. We oh, are real. Oh, we're pretty real. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Let's see what happens. And then... Kaylee, when is your next video coming out? Yeah, Kaylee, when yeah. is your next video coming out? Well, I'm on the D by D channel tomorrow. On the D by D channel tomorrow. I'm following that. On the D. do you like that? It's kind of confusing. I, I love don't it. I know how to fidget with it. I love it. Let's see it. Izzy has opened our snap. She saved it in our chat. <laughs> oh my god. On her She's like, oh, I have a Snapchat account for fans and talking to you guys. She's so typing. I'm log into it too. You have a Snapchat account just for fans? Yeah, that's the one that you have. You I have, 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 a, I have my personal account and then I have my texting kit. I don't have your. Uh oh. Is it a boy? <laughs> no. I, I had that. <laughs> okay, we do not want to know. We no. do not want to know. All right, did she message back? Uh, Izzy is still typing. Izzy has typing. said, oh my god, you guys are literally making my whole year amazing. I'm literally crying. Oh, we love you, Izzy. Aw. Three, two, one. We, we love, love you, you, Izzy. Gabby. <laughs> so it's always I awkward. Gabby, when I you had said I love up. you to me, so. Uh, hey, I did. <laughs> hey, I did on FaceTime. She was drunk, and I was just joking. She doesn't drink. Yeah, I was. I was drinking. She is gonna have some champagne tonight, though. I'm gonna have a I lot of champagne. Like no, not a lot of champagne. The girls got this fidget spinnery thing for Christmas, oh and I love it. It's super cool. Do you like this thing, Sophie? I like jawbreakers. Yeah, Lord Sophie got a jawbreaker. So I think oh, we should I go love live. You guys, I love watching your videos. They're so cool. Oh, this is cute. Quite a She's speaking in Latin. <laughs> She's summoning a demon in her household. Oh my god. Gabby! It's her ASMR. Can we understand it? She's summoning a demon. And that, my friends, is what drives me to do more with my mare. She just stands there staring at the house until I come. <laughs> Lots of hay out there still. And she's like, come on, Laura, come and hang out with me. Let's see if she meets me. That's always the best sign. Over a year ago, when I was contemplating buying a horse, I had so much anxiety. I was like, Laura, you're never gonna ride her. You're never gonna like, you don't know what to do with a horse. Oh, it's dark in here. It's dark out. So over a year ago, when I was contemplating on like, if I should get a horse, if I could recreate the situation that happens to me every time I ride the Pasofinos, could I do it? Could I get a horse? Could I be everything she needed? Could I, could I, could I pick a horse? Could I like, 
there are so many questions I had about if I was good enough to have a horse and so many people told me I was not good enough to have a horse and of course I was so worried that they were right but I didn't let it stop me because I knew in my heart what was right for me and I was brave and I believed in me and it was me that bought a horse it was me that went and picked a horse get your eye clean it was me that decided to buy her. It was me, well, I mean, and my family that helped me, that brought her home. It was me that was brave and, and willing, and I brought her home, and you guys, we're doing it. Like, we, it's a year later, and we are actually doing it, and it's been this crazy, long, amazing journey. Be nice, Penny Pickle. Be nice. That's your New Year's resolution. Be nice to the ponies. Be nice to my ponies. <laughs> be nice be nice sweet girl yeah oh, what was that like a boo boo yeah anyway we are doing it and I want you guys to know like that sometimes in life people will shoot you down and people will be sure that you can't handle it you have to know what's in your heart and you have to know what you can handle and what you can't and I wasn't for sure certain that I could handle a horse especially a horse like Penny, I felt like God came and took over my body <laughs> and said, you can do it, Laura. And we're doing it, you guys. We are doing it. Goodbye, Penny Pickle. Goodbye, sweet girl. If you do anything this year in 2022, let it be believing in yourselves, guys. Believe in you. Believe that you can do things. Believe that you have what it takes to succeed in your, at your dreams. Believe in it, even if other people don't believe in it. Today, I'm gonna cook a ham for my family for Christmas, for New Year's dinner. This weekend is basically the last couple, of, is the last couple of days of the holiday. And soon we'll be back in the daily grind, living life, doing homeschool, riding in lessons, taking care of the horses, hanging out with friends if COVID gets better. COVID is so bad right now. And I wanna take this last weekend before school starts back up to really cement all of my, all my resolutions. I want to serve more. I want to get closer to God more. I want to spend more time doing the things that I love and less time doing the things that I feel like I have to do. There are so many things that I want to do this year and sometimes that doesn't happen. Sometimes you wake up on New Year's Day and you're like, what am I going to do? <laughs> what do I have to do this year? But this year I have so many dreams and Penny did that for me. Penny did that for me, you guys. It's amazing how the love of a horse can change your whole life. I feel like Penny is my retirement plan. She is what I plan to do when the girls grow out of me. I plan to do her, learn Penny, ride Penny, and make a whole different journey for just us. Hey guys, we've been working on this circuit maker and uh, to end this video, I'm gonna show you what we made. It's not the best work. It's our second, third try, I think, but we're, gonna, we're getting better. So I made this one and I screwed up on the eye. There's supposed to be an eye, don't give a flock. <laughs> And there's the uh, rooster chicken. And we're gonna we're gonna actually take this off and redo it in a, another day. Make something better on there, maybe better font. And Sophie just made this one of the Dalmatian puppy. It's hard to tell, but once you have white paper in there, it looks good. You put a liquid in there like a coffee with milk and it would look good. Anyways, we're just working on our circuit making different projects and I'm already sick of doing it, so. Probably gonna make some decals for the horse trailer though, and that will be fun. I wonder if we can put like real pictures of our horses on our horse trailer. Whoa. So, but I think we need markers for that and we have to draw and stuff, so. Anyways, look forward to seeing that sometime soon. Anyways, that's it for this video. We'll see you tomorrow. Don't you know that you're beautiful?